3Press is a three component compression system consisting of a padding, a compression, and a cohesive bandage layer. The 3Press compression bandaging system is indicated for the management of venous leg ulcers and related conditions. 3Press may be used on patients with an ankle circumference of 18 centimeters or larger when padded. Compression data indicates that the 3Press compression system provides sustained compression in the 30 to 40 millimeter of mercury range for up to seven days at the ankle when applied according to packaged insert directions. 3Press is not indicated for use on diabetic patients with small vessel disease or on patients with an ankle brachial index, ABPI, of less than 0.8. Doppler ultrasound is recommended to rule out arterial disease. 3Press should be applied by personnel that has received training on the proper application of the system. Before applying the first bandage, Check the ABPI, Ankle Brachial Pressure Index, to determine if arterial disease is present. If the ABPI is less than 0.8, do not apply the system. Confirm the ankle circumference is greater than 18 centimeters. Ankle circumference may change as edema is reduced. Clean the wound and apply an appropriate dressing before applying 3Press. 3Press is not intended to be a primary dressing. When applying each bandage, make sure that the patient's foot is at a 90 degree angle to the lower leg. Layer one is the padding bandage. Wrap the padding absorption layer with the fluffy cotton side against the skin. Start applying the bandage proximal to the base of the toes. After two turns for fixation, Wrap the bandage across the back of the foot and then enclose the heel. Stretch this layer around bony prominence such as the heel to increase conformability. Using a spiral technique with 50% overlap, continue to wrap the leg to just below the knee. Smooth the bandage after each turn. Please note, when applying a compression system to the leg, it is important to enclose the heel with all layers of the system. Layer two is the compression bandage. When applying each bandage, make sure that the patient's foot is at a 90 degree angle to the lower leg. Hold each bandage as shown, so the bandage unrolls flat against the foot. Start applying the bandage proximal to the base of the toes. After two turns for fixation, Wrap the bandage across the back of the foot and then enclose the heel. Wrap up at a 45 degree angle with 50% stretch and 50% overlap. Continue horizontally around the leg Then wrap down at a 45 degree angle, continuing to use 50% extension and 50% overlap. Continue this technique to just below the knee. Note, to assist in extending this bandage at 50%, the rectangular pattern on the bandage will form a square pattern at 50% extension.
Cut off any excess bandage and secure the end of layer two with the tape strips provided. Layer three is the cohesive compression bandage. Start wrapping the cohesive compression bandage proximal to the base of the toes. After two turns for fixation, wrap the bandage across the back of the foot and then enclose the heel. Using a spiral technique at 50% extension with 50% overlap, continue to wrap the leg to just below the knee. Cut off any excess bandage to avoid a tourniquet effect once you have wrapped to the knee. If you have questions about 3Press or would like additional information, please reach out to your Hartman USA account manager or call our customer service team at one 800 243 2294